Three, two, one. Hey y'all, this is going to be longer than my normal video because I got more to say. I want to get to the um, the CNN interview with uh, with uh, Flip Flop Cammy and Timmy Tampons, but first I need to say a few words about censorship. Today on TikTok, I got my video banned. It got dropped out because they said it was misinformation or disinformation. It said it lacked integrity. Now, basically what it was, was a review of the interview that they did. I gave my honest opinion. Now, frankly, we either have free speech for everybody or we have free speech for nobody. In 2019, you said, quote, there is no question I'm in favor of banning fracking. Fracking, as you know, is a pretty big issue, sure. particularly in your must-win state of Pennsylvania. Sure. Do you still want to ban fracking? No, and I made that clear on the debate stage in 2020, that I would not ban fracking. As vice president, I did not ban fracking. As president, I will not ban fracking. What is she talking about, Joe? Uh, she's lying. She says she's now uh, not for banning fracking. And she said she made it clear in 2020 that when she ran for president on a debate stage that she was not for banning fracking. Well, there's one problem. She wasn't even a candidate in 2020. She dropped out she before dropped then. Out. I can't find any proof. Yes, right. exactly. And I can't find any proof. I looked for it. She said that she said she uh, supported fracking four years ago. It doesn't exist. The big picture here, Judge, and we've talked about this before, that when you take away a teleprompter and the prescriptive remarks from Kamala Harris, she becomes a human Chernobyl. Just one other question about uh, something that you said in 2019 when you first ran. There was a debate. You raised your hand when asked whether or not uh, the border should be decriminalized. Do you still believe that? I believe there should be consequence. We have laws that have to be followed and enforced that address and deal with people who cross our border illegally. This woman is lying. The fact that she says our laws are meant to be followed and enforced, what, you decided that all the laws about mm -hmm. the border shouldn't be followed and there should be consequences, transnational criminal organizations? What the hell have yeah. you done for the past three and a half years? Lies, 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 and more lies. Her and Biden created the problems. Now we're going to be expected to vote for her so she can fix the problems that they created? I don't think so. What I'm seeing now is uh, less journalism and more activism by mm. these journalists that we're seeing on mainstream media. And it has become so blatantly biased that it is unfair to the American people. And I've said this repeatedly, but the biggest threat in America right now is the West, the liberal media, uh, the mainstream media. Oh, one more note. It's becoming apparent that um, Cammy never worked at McDonald's. Hmm. So why lie about that? Why lie? Because she wanted people to think that she's a regular person? Well, she's just a regular person. Thanks, and deuces.